JJ Simmons, you are watching Thou Shall Prosper. Listen, I'm so excited to see what God is doing through this ministry. But um, a few days ago, I was in Atlanta, Georgia. I was at home, well, at the place me and my wife were staying at while we was in Atlanta. And uh, I received a phone call from somebody who was watching the show in Houston. And I just was excited. And this man, a guy right here, he saw the show. Tell him the story on how you ran across the broadcast, my bro. I was actually, um, first of all, thank you for having me. Amen. God, you know, bless God you. be the glory. I thank Amen. you, my brother. Amen. And um, I was I was actually going through some things in my life at the time. I was being I was depressed. I was spiritually depressed. You know, I didn't want to really talk to anyone. Didn't want to reach out to any spiritual brothers or sisters for that matter. You know, I did just didn't want to you know do the religious thing or the Christian thing. You know, Amen. and it just so happened I you know I felt I guess I, I guess you could say I was mad at the world really. You know, okay. and. Uh, decided to cut on the TV and when I decided to cut on the TV I started flicking through channels didn't even really want to look at any Christian channels either I was you know you ever went through that moment to of where course, you just thought course. well that was my moment you know? Know. yes sir and um, anyway I just came across your 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 station man your your network you know okay. and uh, you were talking to some brothers you were ministering to some brothers and uh, I was like man I know this guy you know I, I know this gentleman he's know him from somewhere yes, you know? that's the matter of fact that anyway anyway man uh things that you were saying just really up started uplifting my spirit you know I like, wow and then i was really proud of you because i was like this brother really took the, took it the vision and running you know right, it's right. like so you just you came to the realization that you know who i was yes okay yes, okay yes. and uh um, you know it, that really helped me in, in, in more ways than one and not only that, the, the, the words that you were speaking to these brothers, you know, it just really inspired me, you know, it, it was food to my spirit, my soul, you know, and just started feeding my spirit off you, man, and I just I really appreciate it, and I saw the little number at the bottom right. of, of the program, and I figured I'd give you a call and congratulate you on, on, your, on your vision and on, on your, your awesome walk with God. Amen. So, as y'all hear, um, I was in Atlanta. At the end of the TV show, I put my number on there. If somebody want to call in for prayer, if somebody want to call in to order the product, order CDs, or order a copy of the show. And this man of God saw me on TV and gave us a call to let us know that he was watching the show. And to me, it is very important that all my audience, that y'all see that, that the world is being touched through watching this ministry. And that's why I say, you know what, bro, we have to meet up so I can interview you so you can tell the people that people are really watching the yes, show. Absolutely. Let me ask you this question. Uh, what did that do for you, besides you being proud of me, besides you being excited for me running with the vision, what did that do for you and you running with your vision? Well, actually, you know, I have to say, man, you know, every time you hear a brother speaking the word of God or helping people out in the streets in any kind of way, it feeds your spirits and starve your doubt. You know what I'm saying? And, and it just... It, it, it made me just want to hit the ground running, man. You know what I'm saying? And and, and I, I just, I was at a crossroad at that moment. You know what I'm saying? Now I feel like I have a direction. You wow. know what I'm saying? And I really appreciate you and your ministry. Man. Amen. Thank, Thank you. you. God bless you. Where we go, where we go, where we go. go, go. When we go, when we go, when we go, go, go. Came to it 145, feeling sick to my stomach like I'm finna vomit. Spirit's about as low as my eyes. Thinking to myself, I know the end coming, but I can change myself, rearrange myself. Lucifer's lies. Homie at the wheel like, man, this was a good night. And why I feel like I'm dying inside Yo, let me out the truck Yeah, this my last blunt You mean like forever? Yeah, I gotta get myself together God speaking to me Are you equal with me? Don't you know I'm real as all these people you see? Don't you know I made you unique? Follow me, I'll get you back on your feet Walking through the valley of the shadow of dead men does anybody care about us? Can anybody tell us what happens? When we go, when we go, when we go Walking through the valley of the shadow of dead men Does anybody care about us? Can anybody tell us what happens?
tell us what happens Where we go, where we go, where we go Big brother prayed in the kitchen Put a little tears so deep you could go fishing I said when I pray God don't listen But when you prayed I got redemption I was never the same But I never felt worse pain Than when I told my homies I'm out of the game And I ain't bluffing Man stop fronting Wreck a deal on the table and you don't want it uh -uh. And that was when I went from a boy to a man In the 90210 in the studio, about to sell my soul, Salah. Then I weighed a rap game goodbye. Back on the plane, back to the A. Back in my lane, back in the day. I Walking through the valley of the shadow of dead men. Does anybody care about us? Can anybody tell us what happens? Where we go, where we go, where we go? Walking through the valley of the shadow of dead men. Does anybody care about us? Can anybody tell us what happens? Where we go, where we go, where uh, we go? Fresh off the jet, nightmares, a cigarette, smoke in my chest. Homies wonder what's going on, don't know what to guess. They looking like, where he at? We getting these checks. He had 16 teeth that was solid gold, long dreadlocks, and one day he was gone. What are you? We miss you, we call you, but you don't even bother to pick up the phone. So eventually we decided to leave you alone. You turn your back on the whole city, little homie, you wrong. Or maybe you right. Maybe you found a true meaning of life. Maybe you got with God. Maybe I might do the same, but you became is something I like. But I don't even know where you are. Cause you never came back where we hanged at. Walking through the valley of the shadow of dead men Does anybody care about us? Can anybody tell us what happens? Where we go, where we go, where we go Walking through the valley of the shadow of dead men Does anybody care about us? Can anybody tell us what happens? Where we go, where we go, where we go